When I told you all that I design and build custom furniture, you all said that you were interested in getting easy to follow plans to try out building yourself. So today I'm gonna give you your first one. I love building handmade furniture. There's something about creating something yourself that you use that's functional and strong and beautiful that just adds so much life to a home. This coat rack does just that. When I first built this, it was simply to fill a void behind my door in my old house, but it ended up being one of the most hard working items in my home. It kept clutter from building up when we walked in the door, and I knew I had to repeat that in this new home. The only power tool that you don't actually have to have but would be really beneficial is a drill. You could use a screwdriver by hand, but I wouldn't recommend it, that would take a lot of time. Just if you plan on owning a home, buy yourself a drill, it's gonna make a lot of projects a lot easier. Next, you will need two one by sixes. The standard length is eight foot and I cut mine in half, but you can measure and use whatever length you need and your lumber yard should cut them for you. Once you have them, you're gonna wanna stain them with whatever stain your heart desires. I chose Minwax and Espresso. You just wanna apply the stain per the instructions and let it dry overnight. I am using these hooks that I found on Amazon and I highly recommend them. Next, you just wanna place the hooks wherever you'd like them to go, space them out evenly, and attach them with the screws provided. And when you're done, you've got your coat rack. My favorite thing about this is that when you go to attach this to the wall, you can hide the screws behind the hooks right there. Now just attach it to studs or anchors in the wall, and you've got yourself handmade coat racks.